The 10 second Telestrator allows you to select a video from your iPhone 3GS or iPhone 4 and to analyze it frame by frame. You can play it in slow motion or freeze the action while you comment and mark up the frames. The app can be used shoulder to shoulder to give on the spot instruction or you can record your analysis generating a new video to your PowerChalk.com video locker. With version 2 you can work offline, recording your analysis session for later upload. Here's a quick walkthrough of a typical session starting at the main screen. If you don't have a PowerChalk account, use the register button to create one. They're free and they're necessary if you want to record an analysis session. With your account established, log in and supply your credentials. You are taken immediately to the Select Video dialog. You can film a new clip or select one from your library of movies. Here I'll select an existing clip, a golf swing shot from my iPhone 3GS. If the clip is longer than 10 seconds, the first 10 will be used. If you want a different segment, use the trim bar to reduce the clip to frames you wish to analyze. Select Choose to load the clip. iPhone movies are best shot landscape with the thumb on the right. If you shoot otherwise, use the rotate buttons to orient the thumbnail image until it is standing up. Select Done. With the clip loaded, you can swipe your finger back and forth in the slide area to move the video playhead. You can also set the desired frame rate and tap the scrub area to stop and start playing at that speed. Tap the reset icon to go back to frame 1. Use the plus and minus keys to go forward or back exactly one frame. The middle button sets the draw color and draw mode. Here I'll tap it to change to box draw and again to change my color and select yellow. I can now drag my finger in the video area and create reference points or to draw attention to elements of the motion. Drawn elements stay on the screen until they are erased with the trash can icon. Elements are erased last to first. Hold the trash can button down for two seconds to erase all. So far my markup and video control have been useful for gaining insight but they haven't been recorded. Nothing I've done is captured until I hit the record button. Recording starts using my current position in the video so I'll get where I want to be and hit record. When I do the recording indicator begins to flash and all markup is erased. This is so I don't make reference to a line or point that was never captured. Again, I'll draw reference points and step through the clip, adding voice comments with my headset plugged in. Hitting the record button to stop, I'm asked to supply the subject, title, tags, and more for the new video. The new video will render in 5 to 10 minutes and be saved to my video locker at PowerChalk.com. From there I can watch it, share it, transfer it, embed it into a blog, and more. Recording sessions are limited to 8 minutes. Remember the audience will likely be on a mobile device, so plan your analysis before you record and make your comments clear and concise. If you've been working in the offline mode, you can upload the analysis session the next time you log in. If you create another session without uploading the saved offline session, it will be lost. For more detail and more sports motion tools, Visit us at www.powerchalk.com. The PowerChalk site provides advanced Telestrator tools that require no software installation. PowerChalk is for serious athletes and coaches.